done comedy, it, it's a vulnerable, weird thing. <laughs> like, how how vulnerable do you get when you go for it? I always say it's so much harder to do comedy than it is to do drama because if you aren't fully committed with everything you got and you got your whole heart out there, then people aren't going to laugh. It has to be real or it's not funny. And yet, do they laugh in the moment or have you had to do comedy where it's, you know, it's a set and, you know, the crew, like, is in a good way not <laughs> BSing you. They <laughs> laugh when they laugh and they don't when they don't. And, you know, you kind of go like, la da 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 And there's no sound whatsoever. And you kind of walk home and you're like, okay, cool. Day, just average day at work. Like, do, what do you do in the silence when you're going for it? You know, there have been many a Wednesday matinee where I hit my punchline and there's a, you know, it happens. It happens on stage, too. So you wait for it, and when it doesn't come, you just keep going. I have never had the courage to do theater. I know. What? I know. What? Well, tell me, teach me, because you are an amazing theater actress as well as a profoundly successful sitcom comedian on a big network but like what happens in the theater when things don't go according to plan or what you know what happens magic that's really? what happens yeah you know it's always a happy happy accident happy mistake I'm I've done many a thing on stage that have uh, you know been uncomfortable awkward through the years I've fallen I've tripped I've gone up on my lines I've sang the wrong lyrics um, I've gone the wrong way I've you know fallen in a hole all the things people's phones have gone off and they've answered them and walked out of the theater we've had to stop a show it's never gonna be as worse as uh, the time I peed my pants in Annie when I was 12 wait what <laughs> Yeah. So, I was, uh, I was like 11 or 12, and it was towards the end of the era of the age where I could play Annie, and they were doing it at this rec center, and the last couple scenes of the show, you cannot leave the stage as Annie, and so I had a cold like the last night of the run, I was drinking tons of water, just so much water, and I got to the last song, and I was doing what I call the pee dance, you know, when you like have to pee really bad and you're doing that thing. So I sit down on my suitcase and I go, maybe far away. And I just pee. And I wasn't, I wasn't like, you know, seven or eight. I was like 12. You know, solid 12, and uh, when it starts, it, it just, it's, it's not going to stop, so. I, uh, I jumped up and down for pop quiz the other day, and I, I might have piddled a little bit. I actually, I was like, well, that's two children for you. Um, okay, I, um, can I please quickly pick your brain about impeachment? Mm -hmm. Your portrayal of Paula Jones, I'm all caught up. I've watched every episode, is extraordinary. Thank you. It is incredible. You're giving this uh, performance that feels so relatable when there's so much bubbling up inside of you and you're trying to hold it all in. How do you do that? You know, at the core of this woman, I find her intention to have been so heartbreaking. The reason that she came forward, the reason that she had to be in the public eye um, was because she was trying to please her husband. That was her main motivation. I think it's going to be kind of surprising to people who tune in because uh, I think the women in this narrative, their story gets so lost because of the way that we looked at this story from a media perspective. You know, these women didn't get to really tell their story and so we're sort of trying to do that now. And so um, I think Paula, at her core, was a woman who was truly trying to please a man. Well, you have all the colors. You check all the boxes. I'm just one of your biggest fans, and I love you, and thank you. Thank you, Anna Lee Ashford. Be sure to check out Be Positive Thursday night on CBS and Impeachment as well on FX and FX Hulu.